Mark Cuban, he's a billionaire and he says that Donald Trump is devoid of core values. Do you agree? He says that the backers, the billionaire backers for Donald Trump will manipulate him and actually make sure that they gain if he goes into power. He's just transactional. You could be forgiven in today's world for actually thinking there's a lot of politicians that aren't completely straight or perhaps slightly corrupt. I said forgiven. I didn't say that I thought that myself. However, in today's world, you really don't know what to believe. I think that is true to say. But what we do know is the energy industry is back in Donald Trump. We know the crypto industry is back in Donald Trump. We know that Elon Musk is vocally back in Donald Trump. Would Tesla win? Would the oil industry win? If indeed he gets into power. What seems certain for me is the banking industry, either way, is one to actually potentially invest in right now. People often say, if you're not investing in tech, which I often do because I think that AI and all that's happening in the tech industry is incredible, what would you go for? I think the bank industry, with interest rates coming down, actually can be one of the biggest gainers right now. I care whether you enter the political field or not, and perhaps financial advisors, including me, shouldn't. We have to, however, know what's going to happen in the future. We have to kind of think about who is in power and does it affect stock. And if we look at the politicians, we have to kind of analyse in our minds what that effect is going to have on the stock market. 44 days to go. Who do you think is going to win the election? What effect do you really think it's going to have?